so we have a caller on the line. We do, actually. You know what I mean? Actually, let me just tell you, Kaz. This brother, this is my brother that's on the line, Rock C. Yeah. And for those of y'all that don't know, you know what I'm saying? Let's just think Stone's Throw Records. This is how All the right. brother got started. Let's talk about the Oh No, Mad Lib. You know what I mean? The list goes on and on. But the brother's super dope, super, super dope. Roxy, you there, man? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What it do? That's my dude, man. What you been up to, man? Oh, man. Working hard or hardly working. You know, getting <laughs> it That's what it is. That's what it is. You know, when we set this up, man, we were going to have you and rapper Big Pooh on the call. But I know yes, he sir. couldn't make it because you guys just dropped the dope album. Tell everybody about the record that you and rapper Big Pooh just dropped. Yeah, Trouble in the Neighborhood, we dropped that about uh, six weeks ago, you know, it's, it's filled with nothing but family, from Alchemist, to T3, to Big Twins, I mean, the list goes on and on, it, it's definitely something that I think everybody should pick up and you will definitely enjoy. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. How's, how's, now, how, what's been the reception? Six weeks now, I know it was dope the first couple yeah. weeks it came out, what's happening now? Are people still, like, buying it? Yeah, you know, it, it, it's funny, like, every day I get, a, you know, at least a few tweets or a few Facebooks, like, yo, I'm rocking this joint or I'm rocking that joint, you know, uh, thanks for keeping the hip-hop. I mean, it, it was weird, because in the beginning, it was like, you know, how would people perceive it, you know, my background and, you know, food's background, but when, when people heard it, you know, they gave it a fair chance, and that's all we could ask, and the reception's been great. I can't ask for anything better. So are you torn with this album, or are you just kind of letting it do its thing digitally? Uh, we we got the physical copies. We got the digital copies. We're actually in the mix of setting up some uh, U.S. and overseas tours as we speak. You know, and doing a few spot dates here and there. So yeah, it's definitely something that we're gonna push full throttle to the max. We're working on another video in uh, two weeks. So, yeah. It's nice. just the beginning. Absolutely. Now I got a question. Now you're from Oxnard. Now a lot of for, from for people that don't know, there's something in the water in Oxnard. You know when it comes to hip hop. Mm -hmm. Can you explain uh -oh. like what's going on up there, my brother? Instant legend. As soon as you drink the tap water. Yeah, exactly. You just start rapping. Yeah, you, you know, uh, the founder of Oxnard, Mr. Burns. You know, he's down with the senses and whatnot. So you know, we be drinking all that. That, that crazy water with those little electrolytes and all that stuff. You know, that, that gives us a certain sound, you know, from the planet Nebula, it seems like, you know? <laughs> nah, but for real, for real, it's like, you know, being from Oxnard, you know, the, the hip-hop game, most people think of the West Coast, they think of L.A. or they think of the Bay. So, you know, right. coming up in Oxnard, we had to fight real hard and go out on and put our show in the road to show that, you know, we got some talent out this way, too, and, you know, the reception has been good over the years. I, I can't believe it. People in other countries that don't know English know about Oxnard. So, I mean, it's a wonderful feeling. Hey, man, peep this. Before we get out of here, man, because we're winding on time, we got one of your songs, but before we hear the song, I know you're a part of a group. Let everybody know about this dope group that's going to be dropping pretty soon. Third Eyes. Yeah, what? you know, with the homegirl Phoenix Flame and the homeboy Black Silver. You know, it's, it's, it's awesome. Some real, real, real hip hop stuff. The comparisons that I've been hearing so far is like a mixture of the uh, Fuji's and Diggable. Nice. Right. So I'm, I'm, nice. I'm real yeah, anxious same. to hear okay. what you know. It's it's that boom bap, but it's some conscious, <laughs> conceptual, raw. It's it's some it's some beautiful. It's a beautiful situation. All right, Rock. So we're going to go out with one of your songs from your you and rapper Big Pooh's album, Get That Mother, with the Alchemists and Whoa. Big Twins. Tell us about that song real quick. Oh, <laughs> uh, you, you know, it's something that gets you animated. You might run your head into a wall or uh -oh. kick a glass. You know what I'm saying? It's one of them songs that might make you rob yourself. <laughs> <laughs> we really appreciate you, Roxy, for coming on the show today. Was there any shout appreciate outs or where we could find you on Facebook or Twitter or anything like that? Uh, Roxy Ox, you can find me on Facebook and Twitter is Roxy805. You know, everybody out there knows my motto, hold me down, I'll hold you up, you know. Wow. Shout out to everybody that's been holding me down from day one. I'm going to keep doing what I do and I'll let you there. Well, what? Much, Much respect. respect. Appreciate you, Roxy. Okay.